Don't be fooled by the beauty of this magnificent waterfall and the gorgeous rainbow. Visitors are often getting too close to the edge and paying a deadly price. When you're walking around this area, you gotta be really careful, especially when you're at the top of the falls. You can see a lot of these rocks are wet and slippery. Just in the last few years, there's actually been two fatalities from people getting too close to the falls, trying to get in that perfect position to take a selfie. Both victims fell to their deaths. Signs spell out the perils, warning, deaths have occurred in this area. And this, danger, numerous fatalities, and serious injuries have occurred. The Catterstill Falls in New York State are actually taller than Niagara Falls. And the spot is growing in popularity as word of its beauty spreads on social media. They're going off trails. They're trying to get too close to the edge of cliffs. Sometimes they're backing up and falling or they're slipping. No picture is worth losing your life. Donna Kennedy's 17-year-old son Ezra lost his life at the falls. This photo of Ezra and his friends was taken there the day he died. Ezra is not a reckless person. I think he just wanted a closer shot and it's experienced hikers and inexperienced hikers that have been lost there. A new viewing platform has been constructed to offer a safe place for selfies. These stone steps have also just been installed to make the beauty spot safer. But even on the authorized hiking trail, this tourist tripped and had to grab the rope. So keep in mind, stay on the trail, watch your footing, wear the right footwear, and remember, water is very slippery.